Hello everybody, I'm Jeff Phillips and welcome to this week's webisode. Every week I bring in a new business to help share tips and advice within their industry. And today I'm happy to announce that I have Billy. And Billy, welcome to the show. Thank you, Jeff. I'm glad to be here. Sure. Why don't you explain to everybody a little bit about yourself and what you do? Well, thank you for this opportunity. Uh, my name is Billy Mason and my business is Mystic Merchant. And I design and handcraft uh, meaningful tal talismanic jewelry. Uh, I have been doing this since 1979. That uh, started from my journey around the world and ended up in India and then Sri Lanka where I discovered the gemstone business. And from there have pr processed, uh, processed into um, working with the energy of gemstones to create meaningful jewelry for people that are looking for something that's different than uh, mass-produced jewelry. Okay. So that leads me to the first question then. So why would somebody uh, make a, a custom-made piece of jewelry? Well, what I've found is, is that many people want to celebrate and commemorate uh, meaningful experiences and um, celebrations in their lives. And they come to me looking for the opportunity to sit down with a jewelry designer who has the skill and expertise that I do to create for them um, images and symbols that they can wear and use as a daily reminder of um, that experience that they want to remember and celebrate, co to commemorate. So I'm able to take their ideas, their photographs, their images, do an interview with the client and find out what it is particularly, really refine what it is that they want to enjoy and remember. And then once that process is completed, to do drawings for them uh, and to show them a selection of gemstones that I have available. And because I'm a lapidary, I can also do custom cutting of gemstones and combine them in unique and unusual ways with gold and silver and create unique pieces that are impossible to find at a, a commercial jewelry store. Okay, great. Now, I don't know a lot about your industry, but why don't you tell me a little bit, what is a, a personal talisman? A, a talisman is a um, touchstone that a person uh, wants to have created to commemorate and remind them of joyful and delightful and wonderful experiences in their life. And if they're transitioning through a difficult time uh, or with a spouse, a relationship, or with parents or children, they can find that it's a, a wonderful way to remember that the nat natural side effect of gratitude is happiness. So it's really about creating a mirroring for them to remind them that, yes, this is difficult and uncomfortable. I can choose to be grateful. And from that gratitude, find joy even in difficult and uncomfortable experiences. So it becomes very meaningful as a process of learning to deal with life on life's terms and to still find joy in it. Okay, very good, thank you. Um, when, I, when you mention custom jewelry, I think of you know, getting rid of some of my old jewelry and whatnot. So can you take, or, or how do you recycle old, say gold jewelry and make it into a new piece that's very meaningful? That's one of the wonderful things about what I do because I'm able to um, melt down and refine the, the, the old gold jewelry. Uh, that process fire purifies it and takes all of the old energy that is, was associated with the old experiences in that jewelry, put it into a liquid state and purify it, and then I can take that and create something new that has symbolism and meaning and joy in it that is completely separate from the old experience. And it's also a very economical way to recycle the metal, and that helps maintain the, the uh, quality of the piece as well as uh, moderate the expense. Hmm. Very good. Well, I, I, I'm very fascinated by the topic. I would like to talk more, but we don't have time today. But thank you for the information. And if any of you out there are interested in finding out more about Billy and his business, please check out the website at the end of this video. And if you would like to continue this conversation online, please do so by filling out the box below. So that's all we have for this week. Until next time, take care.